got my secretary right here. How's it going, Cindy? Pretty good day so far. Look at that laptop we got. It's a custom gaming laptop. Well, I mean, she doesn't do much gaming. I mean, it's mainly for Intel on our suspects and whatnot. But anyways, so this is the office we got going on. It's pretty small. Uh, I do want to get some blinds up in here because that sun is freaking bright. Get on the ground, get on the ground. Oh, shit. Damn, he pulled a gun on me. Pretty pit. Oh, crap. Oh, jeez. Let's just tap this guy right there. Get in the car. Get in the car. Okay. Uh, thank you, Bulletproof Windows. Get down on the ground. You should be able to see your back up there. Just off your 20. Welcome to my Golden Games and welcome back to another episode of LSPDFR. This episode is subscriber requested by Demarcus Leonard and he wanted us to use this shop from the last episode that we talked about. We're going to try to get this place for a rental and basically use it as our new base of operations for our bail bonds office. Well, bad news is we couldn't work out a deal. They just weren't they weren't budging. So we're, there was no way we could work out a deal. So we actually have Simeon coming in for the win. And he actually has a little office space for us. So we actually just set up earlier today. And we're going to go over to the shop so you guys can see it. And we're going to go, uh, after we check out the shop, we're going to go and get our first uh, bail bondy. All right, so let's get on the road here. So like I said, Simeon is going to be letting us uh, use one of his offices in the shop. So it should be pretty awesome. And we really don't have to worry about security or anything because Simeon already has the Los Santos Police Department guarding his shop. You know, from uh, the Real Life Mod, if you guys didn't see that, you know, check out my Real Life Mod episodes. I'll have a little annotation up here for that. But, yeah, so we're going to be heading over to Simeon's shop. And, you know, make sure you, you know, check out the Real Life Mod episodes. Those are those are pretty cool, I got to say. And I do plan on doing some more very soon. I just haven't had the time to, you know, record them lately. They take a lot longer to set up and record than a normal LSPDFR episode. Uh, we'll get our turn signals on there. All right, but yeah, I hope you guys do enjoy this episode. If you do, be sure you hit that like button and, you know, maybe consider subscribing if you haven't already. Come on, dude. Let's go. It's a green light. What are you doing, dumbass? Move out of the way. Whoa, freaking dumbass. Okay, I guess I had a yield sign there. My bad. We're, we're good. We're not too far from Simeon's shop now. But I really do hope you guys enjoy this episode, and I hope you guys like the shop that we have set up. Like I said, we literally just moved into Simeon's office, so, you know, we don't have too much going on. We have a few desks, you know, and uh, a few chairs set up for anybody we need to interview. But it, it's a pretty good setup at the moment. All right, come on, guys. Let's go. Green light means go. Don't walk in front of me, person. Thank you. All right, so Simeon's shop is... Oh, shoot, I took the wrong left. I meant to go straight. That's all right. We can take another uh, left here, not right. I did. I don't know what I'm talking about right now. I took a right, not a left. Whatever, let's get around these cars. Coming through. Oh, this truck is so freaking badass sounding. All right, guys, we are getting to Simeon's shop now. Let's see, let's pull up here and our office. We'll, we'll just be here for a moment, so we're just going to park like a dick. No big deal. Let's get inside. All right, so there's the officer there. We'll stop in and talk to Simeon, see how things are going. He's got some new cars for sale. Not bad, not bad. Hey, Simeon, how's it going, man? Thank you for having my back. You came in with the clutch. You're really helping us out here today, man. Oh, no problem. Oh, thank you, man. All right, so we're, let's go check out the office then. Let's get through this way. And the office is actually right here. So, hey, Officer Jordan. How's it going, man? All right, so let's get through the office. Got my secretary right here. How's it going, Cindy? Pretty good day so far. Look at that laptop we got. It's a custom gaming laptop. Well, I mean, she doesn't do much gaming. I mean, it's mainly for intel on our suspects and whatnot but anyways so this is the office we got going on it's pretty small uh i do want to get some blinds up in here because that sun is freaking bright and but we do have two monitors for my desk look at that beautiful Ooh. uh okay hold on a second we got two computers here oh okay i'm just destroying my office right now whatever we'll ignore that so we got a phone here as well and then like i said we got two computers and we actually have a third one back there that I'm not using at the moment. So this is a pretty sick setup. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. I do want to hear from you. But we're going to go talk to my secretary and we'll see who our first bail jumper is. All right, so let's get over here. Hey, Cindy. All right, you got our first contact for me? All right, thank you. 
All right, so our first client is Chris Strick. One, Suspect is believed armed and dangerous. Head to their probable location, execute the warrant. All right, Cindy, thank you. I'm going to head out to the streets now, boys, and we're going to go and upper hand our bail bonder. So, yeah, this guy jumped our bail. It, uh, it, he's wanted for an aircraft ro uh, hijacking. So this is like a $150,000 bond right now. So this is freaking really good for us if we can get this one. Honestly, I'm not sure how we even scored this one since we are our own bail office now. We were working for somebody else. You know, we finally decided to open up our own shop. Let's get through this light. Yes, we made it. What the heck was that? Did it go from green to yellow to green to yellow again? That was odd. Anyways, all right, Cindy, I'm coming up to the suspect's location now. Let's pull inside the shop. Where are they? The back alley? Roger that, Cindy. All right, so let's pull up here. And again, we're going to try to use non-lethal as much as possible. Oh! Shoot! Dispatch, let's get local law enforcement down here. These guys have weapons. Hey, guys, bail bonds. Can you stop right there? Let me see your hands. I'm going to get, you know what? Let's grab the rifle out of the back there. Guys, I need you to stop right there. Get down on the ground. Bail bonds, drop the weapons, boys. You two need to drop the weapons right now. Let's go. Drop it, dude. Get down on the ground. Watch your hands, both of you. Watch your hands. Get on the ground. Let's go. What do you guys think you're doing walking around with MP5s? Everybody, watch out. Bail bonds, move out of the way, dude. Please, my business is in the toilet already. Dude, just keep walking. Bail bonds. All right, Cindy, I'm moving in to cuff this, both suspects. Hands behind your back, buddy. All right, Adam Jacobs. This is not our client. The other guy's our client, so let me get this guy out of the way. Okay, come on, dude. Come with me over here. I'm going to move you out of the way. Right, I'm going to question you in a moment here. I'm just going to keep an eye on him. All right, stand still, dude. Don't try to run. You're going to get tased if you try to run, buddy. All right, hands behind your back, man. All right, Chris, what the heck are you doing today, man? You have the right to shut up. Chris, we're trying to help you out. We bailed you out. $150,000, man. We're good, boys. Oh, put the... Oh, what was that? Get off my suspect. Dude, move the freaking truck. Move your... Where'd my guy go? Are you kidding me right now? Move out of the way, officer. I'm moving your vehicle. Are you freaking kidding me? Is he good? Are you freaking serious? Cindy, we're going to need to get EMS down here. Actually, law enforcement, get an EMS down here. What are you doing? What the? The $150,000? Are you kidding me? You're going to run over my freaking client? Wow. All right, so we're going to wait for EMS to get here. That just freaking blows up right in my face there. Okay, dude, what are you doing today? What were you doing with our client, Chris? You needed some fresh air, okay? Do you have anything else illegal on you? Anything that's sharp that's going to stab me, poke me, or stick me? If I get stabbed by anything, I am going to tase you right in the jaw. Perhaps you have something? Okay, well, thank you for telling me. Do you have a warrant for your arrest? Maybe from another state. Well, I hope you do. I hope you do. Turn around for me, man. Uh, Cindy, I'm going to need to get a pet check in a moment here. Let's go, dude. Just stand still. Don't try anything stupid. A brown bag stuffed with money. That's a little suspicious. A bottle of hand sanitizer and a taser. Cindy, let's get a pet check on Adam Jacobs, born 2-5-1996. See if he has a warrant. He does have a warrant. Okay. Well, that's good for me. I'm going to get paid for whatever he's wanted for. Uh, let's grab this guy here. Come here, man. Adam, let's get over here. I'm going to place you in the back of my patrol car. I know it is a Dodge Ram 1500. This thing is freaking beautiful. I'll put in the rear seat. Okay, oh, man. Get in the back here. It does have a cage, so you're not going to be able to worm your way out. There we go, and let's close the door on him. Oh my goodness. Ooh, look at that beautiful F 450 ambulance. This is dispatch. Uh, the fire truck is on the scene. Cleared from the call. Return to Davis. Is my guy fine then? Whoa, what? No, he's not. Okay, so there we go. They're going to try and work on this guy now. Oh, come on. It's $150,000. 
And if you guys know, from the last episode of the Bail Bonds episodes, we uh, were able to get a really high stakes bond. So we got a lot of money for that one. That's actually where we found that first office that was for sale, which we weren't able to get our hands on. But anyways, let's see if they're able to revive them. Come on, EMS. I hope you guys are enjoying this episode so far. Again, if you do, seriously, hit that like button. Let me know what you think in the comments below. And share the video to all your friends if you can. Or, you know, to anybody you think might like it. Yes! Okay, they were able to revive him. So we're going to get paid for it. We might only get a small percentage of it because we're not bringing him in. But it's not even my fault. It was this state trooper right here. I'll move out of my way, man. Look out. Ma'am? Ma'am? That was not cool. That was not cool at all. I am getting my full amount of my bond for that guy, okay? Yeah, that better go in your report that it was your fault for hitting him. Alright, dispatch. We are code 4 on this. We're going to be heading down to the jail and taking uh, Adam into the prison. Alright, so we are clear on this. Let's go check this vehicle really quick. Uh, just to make sure, this might have been one of their vehicles. Ooh, that is a really nice-looking Mercedes. Or is that supposed to be a uh, Maserati? All right, Cindy, let me get a plate check on a Serrano 84 CTY 402. Target license plate. Jake Eight, Hutcherson. Four, Charles, Tom, zero citations. Four, zero two, okay, so this no, was not either of their vehicles. All right, so I'm going to leave that be. We're going to head down to the station now, get this guy dropped off. Oof, damn, that was freaking crazy. What are you doing outside the truck, dude? Did one of the officers let you out? Officer, are you freaking playing games with me now? I will freaking pop your tire. I don't have my uh, switchblade on me. Okay. Dude, I need you to get back inside the vehicle. All right, turn around for me, and you're going to go in the back seat again. Get this door open. This freaking officer is messing with me like that. Are you serious? All right, let's get him in there. Close the door. And now we'll get him down to the station. All right, Cindy. We are code four. We are heading down to the nearest jail. Uh, we're about a mile from the location. Ooh, that was a close one. All right, ooh, this engine is freaking sick. Let's go in first person really quick, see what it looks like again. Terrier, not too bad. The gauges don't seem to work, but overall it looks pretty sick, and you can actually see in the back. See our suspect sitting back there. Oh, let's get through the light. We're good. Oh, man, look at that sunset. Oh, I forgot to mention, we are patrolling in real time right now, so basically it... Oh, nope, my phone won't pull out. Yeah, so we're patrolling in real time, so it's 7.38 p.m. right now, and it's actually going to go you know, in real time. Anyways, we are almost to the station. Cindy, we are about a quarter mile from there, so we're going to be getting this guy dropped off soon. Whoa, that was a good jump. You know what? Let's send it. No, no, there's a truck right there. If that truck wasn't there, I would have sent it. If I did send it with the truck there, I would have just smacked right into the back of him. And there's a car in front of him, too. That would have been a really big accident. All right, we're arriving to the station now. Let's pull down this way, and we will go downstairs, yikes. Okay, there we go. And we're pulling into the parking lot now, dispatch. Are you kidding me? There's no drop-off point here? Uh, Cindy, I'm going to have to flip back around and go upstairs. Looks like we're going to have to take this guy in the long way around. All right, let's flip back up this way. Man, listen to this truck, though. Oh, nice burn out there. Uh, we'll pull up right here. We'll just park like that. That's good. All right, let's get this guy out. Okay, Adam, come on. All right, Adam, let's get up these stairs. We're going to walk you into the jail ourselves, and you're going to get booked and processed. Uh, we're probably not going to bail you back out because you did have an MP5 on you, which that's a felony. You were open carrying as well, which is definitely illegal in California. Where the heck is the drop-off point? I could have sworn it was those doors right there. All right, Adam, come on. Let's go, man. That's right, guys. Bail bonds. Come through. You can get this prisoner dropped off. Uh, you know what? I haven't put anybody in a cell up this way before, or in a long time. So we'll drop them off right there. And let me get these cuffs off you, man. There you go. Don't try to screw around, man. Okay, let's get these cuffs off them. There we go. 
All right, good luck finding another bail company because we are definitely not going to bail you out. All right, so let's get up to the office now, get our paperwork and the money. We've got on uh, Magellan Avenue. Target is on foot. Roger that, Cindy. So it's Penny Jameson, wanted for embezzlement. Agent, be advised, suspect may be armed and dangerous. Use caution. Roger that. All right, so let's back out this way. What is this guy doing? I do not, do not want to hit that G-Wagon. All right, uh, Cindy, we're about a quarter mile from the location now, so we should be arriving there momentarily. This is their most current up-to-date location. Roger that. We're actually tracking their cell phone. Good idea, Cindy. Man, this is why I hired you. You know what's up. Uh, let's get the turn signals on there. Beautiful. And we will take a left down this way. Yeah, here we go. All right, Cindy. Cindy, I've got a visual on our bail jumper. Let's pull up over this way and flip around here. And let's get our lights on, stage two. Hey, ma'am, let me see your hands. Bail company, get on the ground, ma'am. On the ground. Bail company, let's go, ma'am. Dude. Dude, can you can, can you stop, man? I'm trying to do my job here. All right, hands behind your back. All right, Penny. Why did you jump bail today, huh? All right, let's see if we can question her. Penny, you want to tell me what you're doing? Why'd you jump bail? You're trying to relax your soul. Penny, you got to go to your court dates. If you jump your bail, we're going to lose a lot of money. And another warrant goes right back I out said, on you. I said, listen, you know you'd I said, lose listen, the money well, that we it. put out, right? Any money involved, in everybody nice loses. Guy? So I'm, I'm going to get you back down to jail. Now, I've if you want to work man. with me, we'll bail you, you back out tonight. And then you'll be right back out on the street. Just don't jump bail again or everybody loses here. We're trying to help you. What? Did this guy just hit my car? Hold on a second. Coming. Excuse me, Penny. Sir, stop right there. Stop. Stop. Stop, ma'am. Ma'am, did you just hit my car? Stop. Ma'am, right now, get out of the car. Oh, what the heck? Ma'am, stop right there. You just hit my truck. Hands in the air, now. Do you have your ID on you? Ma'am, let, let me see your ID. Don't try to walk away from me. Uh, Carly Ray. All right, dispatch. Let me get a pet check on a Carly uh. Ray. Born 726-1954. I'm sorry, Cindy. I keep forgetting to call you Cindy. Uh, license valid, no active warrants. Okay. So I'm going to let her go then because she doesn't have any warrants. Um, Ma'am, are you all right? Hold up. Let's question her really quick. Ma'am, what, what are you doing? Are you all right? You're all over the place. Involuntary eye movement. Alcohol intoxication. Ma'am, have you been drinking today? You have the right to shut up. Okay. Do you have anything on you that's illegal that's going to poke me, stick me, or stab me, ma'am? Nothing illegal. Okay. I'm, turn around for me. I'm going to search you. I knew I shouldn't have taken this I'm, I'm with the bail bonds company. I'm not a police officer. I'm just going to search you. You hit my vehicle. If I find something on you, I'm going to call the police. Partially eating up an Adam Burger and a Michael Owens game coffee mug. Oh! I didn't realize you were a fan. I apologize for that. Okay, ma'am, you're free to go. Go get back in your car. Go I'm gonna on, let it be. Get the insurance here. company will take care shit. of it. It's fine. Traffic don't see this okay, shit. so anyways, Penny, no thank way. you for standing around for me. I'm gonna pat you down now, so turn for me. Thank you. If I find anything on ya, let, let's just hopefully, it's nothing major, all right? Let's see what she's got on her. A small pouch of the green stuff, a drone phone, and an Avo number nine cigar. Okay, so this green stuff, Thank you for letting me know about it. Well, I can dismiss that. We can get rid of that. It's not going to affect you. If you, you didn't tell me about that, you love the Penny, face my way. Then if you didn't tell me now. about Penny, Penny, look at me. Look at me. If you didn't tell me about the green stuff, that would have been a felony charge. So think. Okay. What are you? Ah. Uh, I'm going to ignore that. All right, Penny. I'm going to grab you here. Let's uh, get in the back of my car. Come on, let's go, Penny. Let's get you back down to the station. All right, let's get her in here and put her in the rear seat. There we go. Again, I hope you guys are enjoying this episode so far. 
All right, Penny, let's go get back inside. You know, let me know in the comments below if you want to see more of these types of episodes. I really do love hearing from you in the comments. So let's back out here now. We will turn our lights off. There we go. Scroll lock. And we'll head over this way. So my truck doesn't actually look like it was scratched up at all. So that's good. Whoa, okay, lag. Hopefully it's not going to crash on us. All right, so we're going to get Penny down to the station and get paid for this one. Ah, uh, Penny, let's get you down into the cells. We'll let you go once we get you inside, and then we will try to get you out tonight. If if it takes a little more paperwork, it may be tomorrow. So let me let you go right there, and let me release you from the cuffs here. We, we should be able to have you out tonight. I mean, it is 7.50 almost p.m. right now, so we'll, we'll see. I know it may be tomorrow night. Just next time, don't miss your court date, please, Penny. Uh, let's get to her out here and close the cell there. All right, guys, let's get outside here, get back to our office, see how Cindy's doing. I believe that was our last bail jumper for the day, so there's nothing else on our list. What is this guy think? He's doing a burnout right in front of a police station. Yeah, smart idea, buddy. Smart idea. All right, so anyways, let's get back inside the Dodge Ram here. This thing is so freaking awesome. He wants to do a burnout? I'll show him a burnout. Let's get right up next to him here. Yeah, dude. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I call a burnout. Let's race this Mercedes. Just beat her. Look at that. that beautiful. All right, so anyways, yeah, we're going to be heading back to Simeon's now. Well, I mean, it's Simeon's shop, but our office is in his shop. Uh, if you guys want me to come up with the cool bail bonds office name, let me know in the comments below what you guys think it should be called. You know, I, I, I don't know. I, I haven't really thought about that. So let's get over here and get over to Simeon's. Oh, man, that sounds so good going through a bridge. Boy, I love this freaking truck. It sounds so beautiful. And it handles really good, too. Okay, nobody saw that. That guy definitely swerved right into us. Okay, we're going to try to do a drift around this corner here. Let's see if we can do it. I hope it doesn't crash on us because it's getting a little laggy. Oh, okay, that was a little bad, my bad. All right, let's pull up in front here. Ooh little lagginess there jeez i don't know what's going on with the lag i right, pulled up here and let's go speak with cindy see how things are going that's just the gun range down the street hey man how's it going all right cindy what's going on successful day today we got everybody that we needed to uh nothing else on the list for today no all right sweet it looks like you can head home then if you want to get out of here you want to file a few more paperwork? Okay, that's fine. Man, that is a really awesome computer you got there. Anyway, so I am going to just sit down here, work up a little bit more work, get a little more work done, and then I'll be heading home for the night. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Let me know what you thought in the comments below. Have a great day, guys, and see you next time. Maybe consider subscribing if you haven't already, and be sure to hit that little bell icon on the channel. That way you stay notified when the videos do go up. All right, guys, take it easy.